The other class final you said my final game last night was Bentonville at Texarkana. And Razorback fans packed the house as Texarkana made its first trip in the semi since 1990. And Bentonville wasn't getting anywhere on the ground last night as Texarkana held the Tigers to just 99 yards rushing. But Bentonville quarterback Alan Schlagan a half passed for 218 yards and two first half touchdowns. Schlagan has since went out to Weston Geigel here at the end of the third quarter. And that was set up junior Brian Favors 28-yard field goal moments later. Early in the fourth quarter, Bentonville led 20 to 14. But there's no quit in the hogs. This was exciting. Texas County quarterback Josh Potter lost one up to Roy Ross. And the hogs are in business all the way down to the Bentonville 50. 15 yard line, there's four minutes left. But the Tiger D steps up. Bentonville forced three incomplete passes, and then with one out the clock, Bentonville, your Tigers are going to Little Rock. Final score Tigers 20, Texarkana 14. Oh, this is unbelievable. Uh, you know, our kids uh, to go on the road and, and beat a terrific Cabot ball club and come down here to Texas Cannon and beat an outstanding Texas Cannon football team. It's just unreal. You know, our, our kids, as well as myself, are on cloud nine right now. But uh, we got to come back down to earth real quick and get prepared to play next week. Next week, Coach Weir and the top ranked Tigers will play El Dorado for the 5A state championship. It's the first time ever for both teams to play in the finals and should make for a big crowd. Kickoff is at 6.30 next Saturday night at War Memorial Stadium. Bentonville and Southside are joined by Russell from the 